Well, today we're talking about something we've never talked about on the channel before. It's true. But it's kind of important. It's kind of a big deal. Yeah. So today we're talking about how do you go to church while you're traveling full time? Or if you're a full time RVer, how do you go to church? How do you attend church? Yes. If you attend church if at you all. Do it all. We grew up in the church. We did. Different churches. Way different churches. So a little <laughs> bit of background about us is I grew up in Christian Assemblies of God type churches and... I'm Catholic. <laughs> so we're you can see <laughs> we're just totally opposite uh, church going experiences yes. from our from our youth and from mm -hmm. growing up. Um, now, we are believers. Yes. We are Christians. Mm -hmm. We pray, but we don't go to church. Not religiously. And the reason that we don't is because we travel and, you know, bouncing around week to week, if you just pop into a church, you really don't know what you're going to get. No, you, you, it's hit or miss. And plus, I'm sure a lot of people do it and it is a hit or miss process. And plus it's hard for us because we have such different ways we church. Yeah. <laughs> I'll yeah. put it that way. But, so we wanted to tell you about a new church. That's not a new church, but it's a new church style of church yeah and so for those of you who don't know or haven't watched our channel we've mentioned it in the past but you might not have picked up on it my brother is a pastor yes and he preaches at a place called crossroads in poplar bluff missouri mm -hmm. and he would preach intermittently in the afternoons afternoon service but mostly he was bringing in other preachers you know to kind of get exposure for those people so that people could go out to their church if they liked yeah. Uh, that preacher they could go to their church mm -hmm. so he was really just trying to get people in church yes but now he started doing his own thing and preaching every sunday morning at his church yeah and so and he started an online ministry on youtube yeah so that's what we're here to talk to you about because that's <laughs> going to be that's going to be our new church that's right because <laughs> we don't have a church so that's going to be our new church and so we want to tell you about it. It's called Jimmy Wagner Ministries. We'll leave a link in the description so you can go over there and check mm -hmm. it out. But it is it is unique because it's not just a church. No. He has a program through Crossroads where he helps men who struggle with addiction. Yes. Men who are struggling with addiction, in and out of jail, rough life. A lot of them on their three strikes you're out kind of Thing. Yeah, or at, they're at their rock bottom, and they yeah. need somebody to help. They need somebody to show them the way. Mm -hmm. And so my brother and his ministry, and through Crossroads, they do that. Yeah. They get these guys, they teach them skills and trades. Mm -hmm. They teach them life skills. They help them find jobs, and they turn them into contributing members of the community. Exactly. So it is really a good program. And then, bonus, on Sundays, my brother preaches. Not mm -hmm. just to the guys, but everybody in the community is welcome. Yep. And everybody is welcome. That's right. So there is... Non-denominational. Yeah. You can come as you are. A lot of places you go throughout the country, churches will say everybody's welcome, but they don't really mean everybody's welcome. Yeah. Or you might get some weird looks when you, you walk into you the church. You just don't fit their mold. Yeah, you just don't, yeah. Just don't feel right. And people need a place where they're going to feel comfortable. Some don't go because they can't feel comfortable. Exactly. So they just don't go at all. So Crossroads is a place, and Jimmy Wagner Ministries on YouTube is a place where you can go and feel comfortable. Now, what he's going to be doing is he's going to be preaching on Sunday mornings, but he's not going to just live stream those because, you know, it's a full hour. you got the praise and worship and all that stuff. What he's doing is he's putting it in, like, video format, cutting out the ums and ahs, all the long silences. So all you get is the word. Yes. Cut through all the crap. And give me the good stuff, man. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> so that's what he's going to do. I'm helping out with a little bit of the video production initially until he learns it and figures out. Yeah. So we're having a fun oh, time yeah, putting, the, putting the whole channel together. And it's really been a lot of fun doing that. It is a different and unique approach to how he delivers the word. Yeah. Um, puts a different spin on it. Mm -hmm. Keeps you entertained, engaged. Uh, the first video that he has coming out is talking about David and Goliath. And I know if you are a Christian, you've probably already heard the story of David and Goliath a, a million times. But he did it in a different way. It keeps your interest, keeps it fun the whole time. Yeah. You haven't been to church in a long time, and you got to be there for the service. What did you think? It was, I ain't going to lie, it's way more entertaining than a Catholic service. <laughs> <laughs> I'll be the first to admit Catholics are pretty boring, you know, traditional. 
Yeah. You know? So it's really hard to describe it to you. So hey, take a look. Yeah. For those of you guys that heard me preach before, you know I preach a little different. I don't. I don't have one single note because I don't really know what's going to happen as much as you don't. I mean, I. Here we go. Come on. What's about to happen? I don't know, but I know this: that God is about to bless your socks off. So how do you take a giant down? Do you have the strength? Do you have the power? Do you have the talent? Do you have the skills to take a giant down? Let me ask you this. Turn to your neighbor and ask them, do you have the stones? Whoa! Welcome to Crossroads! Depression is your Goliath! And you gotta run out there and fight! Anxiety is your Goliath! You gotta run out and fight! And you gotta take down that giant! Addiction is your Goliath and you gotta fight! You gotta run out to the battle line and take down that giant! All these things are still in our lives and we were pumped on Sunday, but on Monday we still feel defeated! Come on. I'm not here to give you a motivational speech today! I'm here to give you Jesus! So there's just a little taste of what you're going to get at Jimmy Wagner Ministries on YouTube. But, hey, go over there, give it a chance. If you need a place to go on Sundays to go to church, pop over there. There will always be a video coming up every Sunday over there, so you'll get a new word. And, hey, it might be the word that you need to hear at the moment. So, right. you know. Or you might know somebody who, it, who it's a good fit for. Yeah, and I think this is a good opportunity for RVers, people who are travelers, who may not have a church, people who have mobility issues, who can't get to church, yeah. you know, people who are who are sick, who don't want to risk getting other people sick at church, mm -hmm. uh, but you still need that dose. Yeah. You still need that dose. That's Sunday dose. You know? And so once a week you can get that through Jimmy Wagner Ministries. And the good thing is because he's posting them in video form, you don't even have to be on a Sunday, man. You can go watch those watch videos anytime you want to. Exactly. And you can go back and watch all the previous right, so ones before. Yeah. So it's a good deal so pop over there and hey at least give it a shot check them out we're having a good time with it we're having a good time watching yeah. my brother grow into this new ministry and yeah. he's having a lot of fun with it yeah, yeah and uh and he's helping the community man he's giving everybody a place oh, yeah. to go to worship for people who didn't really feel like they ever had a place to go yeah. to worship yep stick around for a few more seconds because we're going to honor a fallen service member if you want to get involved with helping us help veterans out on the road everything you need to know right down in the description of the video. Appreciate you watching. We'll see you next time. Bye. Bye.